Hey DIYers and everyone out there who needs to sew a button on every now and again. Today on Make Your Mark, we are making needle books, which became popular about 200 years ago. I'm turning mine into Valentine's with the help of our friends at Sulky, the makers of Sulky Rayon Thread, which is the best rayon thread on the market for machine embroidery. I'm using their Convert Sotion palette of threads, which when purchased, include 20 different conversation heart designs that you can embroider on almost anything. Of course, I'm gonna leave everything I used in the description below with links, so take a peek down there. Thumbs up if you like this video and leave me a comment if you have a question about this project or you just wanna let me know you're there. Are you ready? Let's make some needle books for Valentine's Day. Early embroidery can actually be traced back to Cro-Magnon days, or about 30,000 BC. Archaeological finds from this time period reveals fossilized remains of heavily hand-stitched and decorated clothing. The needle was one of humankind's first tools, and the most ancient sewing needles date back to 2800 BC. These didn't have an eye, but a split end which gripped the thread to be sewn. Needles from later than 17,500 BC had the eye at one end and the tapering point at the other, and were made from bones and antlers. The needlebook trend began in the 1800s and grew in popularity until around the 1950s. They were designed to hold the different needles people needed for different projects, and usually they were made from fun scrap fabrics.
I'm gonna leave a link to Sulky and everything I used for this project in the description below. Thumbs up if you like this video, leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and press the notification bell so that you know I have a new video. Make sure to find me on Instagram at TheMarkMontano. Grab any one of my craft books for inspiration. I think you'll like The Big Ass Book of Crafts Volume 2 and I'll see you next week. Happy Valentine's Day.